What up, Long Beach? Welcome to GazetteSports.com. It's JJ and Mike. And over on the west side, the Cabrillo Jaguars are putting together some practices that might be the most excitable in Long Beach. Yeah, after going 0-20 the last two seasons, you can imagine them being a bit downtrodden, but that returner right there, Derek Stewart, a quarterback, seems to have this group pretty excited. Yeah, uh, excited because he's got big targets on the outside in Cruz and Ben. Yeah, Donovan Cruz, just an absolute stud. These helmets, uh, the stealth bomber look that they're all sporting, by the way, probably doesn't hurt either. You say excitable? <laughs> you got to be excited about maybe the best or most improved unit in the Mortal League, the yeah, offensive line. I'd have to say, I mean, and that's, you know, they were coming from a fairly low place last year, but AJ says the dedication has been there since the spring, and you could see it. I mean, they really have improved as a unit and individually, and uh, and if they keep working hard like that, I definitely think most improved unit in the league. Yeah, they've been opening up holes for uh, Andrew Foster and the running backs. Uh, looking good on the other side of the ball. Looking good as well. More reasons to be excited. Those helmets? Yeah, sure. <laughs> and, of course, uh, in addition to the new faces on the defensive line and uh, a stayed tried and true guy like William Curley, you've got the linebackers led by Ari Bayou. Just a ball hawk out there. Yeah, he's really, uh, really a, a, a what would you call it, a runaway Mack truck? For sure. He's not a guy you'd want to step in front of, in other words. <laughs> yeah, neither is Curly. Um, and you probably wouldn't want to get in the way of that guy either, A.J. Luke, <laughs> looking for his first victory at Cabrillo. Uh, the Jaguars, either way, guess what? I'm thinking it could be exciting.